Hey guys, my name is Wes, and today I'm going to show you how to link your account for cross save in the first descendant. So, I know a lot of people have been having issues doing this, so I'm going to show you how it's done. So, I am currently in game right now, and so if you are in game, I am on console, so we're going to try to link our console progression with our Steam and PC or whatever system you play on in our Nexon account. So this is how you do this. So I'm in game right now. So if you on controller, I'm on Xbox, just press and hold the menu button, which is the button I have the three horizontal line. It's the button that is next to the X button. So that's the one you have to press and hold so that bring you to this menu right here. Or if you are in the beginning of the game, in the startup screen then you can just press the option but if you in game you just come here and then come to the option so we're going to click on option and then here you're going to tab over to account and then as you can see mine is already linked and if i have to press this button i'm going to unlink it but when you click on link this is the screen that you're going to have you're going to have this screen right here that says choose your activation method and you can see there is a code down to the left that you can use that code to go to that website and to enter that code or you can use your phone to actually use the barcode the qr code and you can do it that way so i would prefer that you do it via the link so i'm going to show you how to do that so i'm going to that link nexon.com slash link so now, as you can see right here, this is the site where you can just go to Google or Microsoft Bing or whatnot, and then just enter nexon.com slash link, and then you will come to the site. Don't use this because you're going to have a lot of issues. You're not going to find the link that you need. Instead, you're going to use nexon.com activate. And then you're going to, if you click on this right here, and you're going to have this right here and then on this this is where you are going to enter that number that you saw when you came from your console remember you are going from your console to the internet so that's the reason why you have to use that link it's going to give you that option to actually link your account now the reason you're doing it this way if you do it any other way it's not going to work because you already start your game with the first descendant and you have progress and you don't want to lose them, that's the only way you can do it. Now, this is how you do that. Now, once you enter the code, it's going to ask you for an email address. Do not use any email address that you've previously used with a Nexon account. you got to use a new email address, something that you have never used before in a Nexon account. That brand new email address is the one that you're going to use when you have the option to enter an email address. Once you enter that email address, then they're going to ask you to verify. And then you're going to receive a, a number from that account that you just give them, the new email address, and use that code that you receive from them. And then you're going to come and enter it, whatever box they ask you to enter. And then it's going to be verified. Once that is verified, it's going to say that you are all set. And then when you come back to the game, then you're going to see that your account is linked. That means all progress that you made to the game, even if you play 50 days or 15 days, if this is the first time that you link it, all your progress are going to be linked. And from there, you can just link your other account like Steam or PC, whatever platform you play on. And I'm going to show you that mine is working. Now to show you that mine is working because I already linked mine and all my progress are saved between my Xbox and Steam account, and I'm gonna show you that it's working. Now, one of the issues that people are having, they're using an account that they already have with Nexon, and then what's gonna happen, once you link it, you're gonna start a new game. So you're not gonna have your progression. That's the reason why you have to use a new email address. This simply means that you just created a brand new account with Nexon for the first time and then that account is going to save your progress. Now, whenever you play, whether you play on PC or whether you play on Xbox, it's going to, it's course safe. So it's going to be, it's going to be safe. Now, let me show you, prove to you that it is working on Steam. As you can see right now, 
This is my character, so I'm using my Enzo character, so I'm going to switch the character. That way, when I go to Steam, then you can see that whatever I switch to should be there. So I'm going to, okay, let's go out to Blair. So I'm going to use Blair instead. That way, when I go to Steam, so it's going to be Blair instead of Enzo. So Blair is now my main character in the game, as you can see. All right, so I'm going to shut the game down on Xbox. So I quit the game on Xbox. This is how to link your Xbox account and your Steam account or PC or whatever the system. So you're going to log in to the Nexon by going to nexon.com or whatever. Once you log in, you're going to be on this page with your account setting and your account setting. Now you're going to be looking for linked account. Now the linked account is right here. And then uh, down at the bottom, you're going to see you can either link some of your social or whatever, or you're going to come here where it says external connection, and then you're going to click on this link. And then once you are in this link right here, you're going to see that you have Steam, Twitch, Discord or whatever. Discord is not available. PlayStation and your Xbox already been linked since we already went to the process or Nintendo, whatever you want to link. And this is where you just click on link for Steam and then it will link your Steam account that way. You're going to go through a process. You're going to have to log into your Steam via your phone or whatever, but you're going to follow the instruction that is on the screen and then your account will be linked. And once it's linked, then you, would say you have the option to delink. And that means that you know that your Steam account is linked with your Nexon account as well as being linked to your console, whatever it is, Xbox, PlayStation, which is the process that we already went through. Now that you know how to link your Steam account or whatever other account, then I'm going to show you the proof that it is actually working. Now, as you can see that I am in game, and like we said before, my last character was Blair. And as you can see, this is Blair. I still got all the descendant that I talk about first. That means my account is linked in synced. So whether you play on Steam or you play on Xbox, um, you're going to have your progress uh, transfer as long as the system updates. Anyway, guys, I hope this was helpful. Hopefully you get your problem solved. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next one.